No matter how long you've lived here, there are still some places you may not have known about, like a farm dedicated to miniature horses less than three feet tall. ABC 7's Linda Carson has more in tonight's A Place We Call Home. The Fallen Pine Miniature Horse Farm is home to 134 miniature horses. How tall is a miniature horse? Miniature horses measured at the last hair of the mane and 34 inches and under. Or in the last few years, we've started breeding those miniatures with your Shetlands, crossing them over and they make wonderful Arabian looking horses. The little horses love people. A miniature horse just like a big dog. They'll crawl in your lap, you get kisses, you get lo lots of affection from a miniature horse, much more so than a big horse. Judy says a miniature horse can do anything a big horse can do. She doesn't recommend riding them, but she says they're great cart horses. They learn to pull when they worked in, in the mines in England back in the 15th and 16th centuries. And they learn to pull. They love to drive a cart. And a miniature horse, uh, one good sized miniature horse, 30 to 34 inches, can pull 1,000 pounds. Judy is a renowned breeder. All of my stallions are no less than two time national champions. One is eight times a national champion and one is 14 times national champion. I do believe if you're going to raise something, you should raise a quality animal. A 4-H club group meets here and the members show the miniature horses. They bring home a lot of trophies. They're very active uh, all over the state of Florida showing. We go to nationals every year. My kids always are in the top 10 in the nation. And kids 4 to 14 come here for summer camp. We do all types of activities, anything the big horse does, trail obstacle, jumping, liberty, halter, color, you name it, and we do it. Judy says working with the little horses is a healing experience. I've had autistic kids here. I've had all types of the exceptional students here. We work with them. I do five to eight nursing homes here a year where the people come. It's healing for the horses too. This is where Sarasota County Animal Control brings abused or neglected miniature horses. They're put here and uh, we bring them back up to good health. I mean, they do come, some of them pretty sad looking. And uh, we bring them back up to good health and the kids work with them so they're real, real friendly when they leave us. Fallen Pine is open to the public. All you need to do is call ahead and make arrangements for a tour. These wonderful miniature horses and this great farm, one of the reasons the Sun Coast is such a great place to call home. Linda Carson, ABC7, your Sun Coast News. Hi there, Liberty.